Morning Blair, morning Cass. Okay, so yesterday we got, got the door back on. Somewhere on the trip, on one of the many times we had this thing up on the hoist, we put in a dent. Yep. And there is a, a dent here. Right there. And a crack in the paint. And we cracked the paint. So since we are going to uh, the big show, not that the car's going in, but Blair just couldn't sleep at night thinking about this. So we're just going to pop this door off and Blair's going to do a one day repair. Well, I don't need any more of these. No, oh, no. By the way, did you tell me? Where is Lincoln? Oh, and for everyone that is wondering where Lincoln is, while I was on our, my epic 47 day journey across the country twice and a little five day detour to Indianapolis, um, Connor's wife, Jada, was so kind as to take Lincoln because she didn't want him in the kennel, even though Lincoln loves the kennel. Anyway, they have a beautiful house on the river. Uh, Lincoln got his first bath ever, I might add. <laughs> he was looking pretty clean. And uh, so Lincoln is on loan until Connor's off for the winter, and then I, then I get him back. So anyway, he is in a very good place. He doesn't get to lay in piles of Bondo dust or roll around in the mud, but and he has and he has a puppy companion there too. So anyway, Lincoln is okay. He is well. Thanks for everyone asking. Okay, so anyway, and I am going to put a choke on this today since uh, winter's coming. We got to get it to SEMA, and um, there's no choke. So uh, chokes are handy in the winter time. Yes. So. Todd. Our buddy Todd sent me uh, the parts. Uh, he's the guy that re rebuilt this car that has not skipped a beat in 20,000 plus kilometers. So I'm just going to see if I can't do a simple thing such as put a choke on it. Yeah. So anyway, stay tuned. Oh. That's what's happening. And Cassidy. And the lovely and talented Miss Cassidy is here. She's going to give us a hand and polish the hood. We got a little bit of dust because we uh, painted the cave here. So she's going to uh, make it smooth as a baby's bum. Okay. Anyway, that's the plan for today. Okay, my buddy Todd sent me instructions. Right, let's see what it says, Todd. It's got to go this way. You think? Blair, Yo. it has to go this way. The picture they show is wrong. <laughs> well, look, <laughs> they show this sideways. <laughs> So that sideways, it doesn't fit sideways. It's got to fit in the hole. Yes. So the, the bimetallic strip. Right. Okay. That's what I thought. Anyway. So much for the instructions you sent me, Todd. <laughs> <laughs> and then like that's adjusted all the way closed. Well, okay. And you want to set it so it's just closed. Yeah. Well, just. Right there, right? But... I would give it a little more because it's warm well, in here. Well, and you we can't. need this. Well, you can't. That's as far as it goes. You can adjust it. Well, that's what that. That's what this does, doesn't it? There's notches. That's that's all the way closed. So then, when that gets hot, it it shrinks or it expands. Right. It expands. Yeah. Okay. So this. And it's only hanging. On. You got one screw, one bracket. I mean, I'm assuming this goes in here. Put the screw in first. Okay. Yeah, because I'm going to have to, he says you got to fire it up and run it. Might take 10 minutes to open up. Hold on, I think. 
ain't gonna work. Hey guys, the next painful project, we've got a choke, but there should be uh, covers here on both sides. So we do have them, I saw them somewhere. Now we just have to find them and uh, Blair says it's very painful to put them on. So obviously he has no desire to do it. <laughs> if we'd had a little more time, say a few more days, Mike. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can't find them. I think it's a perfect job for me. For all you doubters that say I never work on my cars, you are right, there's a reason for it. Okay, let's see if we can't get the staples out first. I'm thinking that's probably the first priority. Can I do it all from this? No, I guess I should get it up in the air and take the take the tires off, eh, hey, Blair? Okay. What stuff? You got your, oh, go cast. Jesus. Uh. Uh. How many times have you done this in your life, Blair? What? Put these things back in. Mm -hmm. What? But how many times have you done it? Depends on the client. I don't remember. Oh yeah. Look by me. Metal inners, then I make them tighter so I don't run into that. Oh, yeah. And I just make a nice fit. Yeah, okay. It's just a pain in the ass. We got before, I'll show you after. There's going to be a whole lot of swearing going on. <laughs> oh, that one broke. Open this side. Oh, that's got to be quite the staple gun, eh, Blair? Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> I can't get it. There's no fucking way. Still I was thinking I'd right. put it in from this side. <laughs> oh, I could actually. Sure. And then bend it on the inside. Why yeah. the f am I wasting my time? I just how am I gonna line it up? Okay, Ooh, we're baking the baking the door. Yes. Shake and bake. Yes. Ooh. What? Ooh. B 
beautiful. Your <laughs> hey, there we go. Look and don't touch. Anyway, this door is going back on today because tomorrow the green machine is heading to Vegas, baby. Aww. Unfortunately, some of us have to stay and work. You shall remain nameless. And oh, yeah. some of us, like with a big eating grin, get to go to Vegas, baby. Anyway, Aunt Cass is going to Vegas too. We're putting the hood back on. The guy have painted. And Cassidy is working her magic. Oh, look at that, yes. She's ready to rumble. Yesterday, what did we accomplish? On the car, we got, uh, we, we did work on the wipers. We cannot see why they continue to fail. They work perfectly. They work perfectly. We put the choke on, so we now have a choke because it might get cold. Way to Vegas and back. We got these pain in the ass. What do you call these? Uh, a arm covers? What would you call them? Yeah, we got the A arm shields in. What a pain in the ass that was. Pulling out the staples and sticking them back in the holes here. Um, Mind you, I don't have a staple gun that can put staples in metal, so we got those mounted. Uh, what else did we work on? Uh, yeah, we got the hood polished. I managed to put a chip in it right there on the E, because unbeknownst to me, there's two E's. And I put the wrong one in. Yes, yeah, see? See that? See? I put it in, and I tried to tighten it down, and it divoted into the paint. Anyway, no one knows but me. And you, and you, <laughs> and all of our volcano. Right? <laughs> anyway, I won't point out the divot we put on the door, putting it back on, because somebody will see it. 